Hello everybody. I have some ground meat that is frozen. Um, but the kids are wanting something to eat. So I'm going to go ahead and make some floppy joes. Alright, so it calls for one pound of ground beef. And I'm going to be using my multi-purpose steamer uh, with the cover on. I'm going to take this uh, pack of beef here, put it in the bottom of my steamer, no extra water or anything like that, and um, we're going to cook it for four minutes, and then I will be able to bust it apart for... Um, Make my my um, sloppy joes. If you can't get like any of the paper or the wrapper off, just go ahead and wet that chunk of frozen meat. All right, so this is just gonna go with the cover on in the microwave for four minutes. All right, so I just took this out of the microwave for four minutes. Um, like I said, it was completely frozen. I am able to bust it apart with my meat separator so this is definitely a huge time saver if you're coming home from work and you're like oh my gosh I forgot to take the burger out of the freezer don't worry um because it really doesn't matter once you have your steamer all right so I'm just gonna break this up and now I'm gonna cook it as if it was already thawed, so it's going to go in the microwave for uh, about three minutes. Okay, it's been three minutes, so I'm going to replace my uh, burger in the microwave with a um, can of a family-sized can of baked beans. It's going to be going in my rectangular steamer, and then I'm going to show you my ground beef. So that is completely cooked. I'm just going to break it up again. So this is grass-fed beef. There is not, um, I really don't drain my fat off because there's so little fat here. So any liquid that's in here is strictly just um, like meat juices. All right, so that is busted up. Now we're going to follow the directions. So the directions are to add a pound of ground, ground beef, the seasoning, uh, one can of tomato paste, and a, can, a cup and a half of water. I've measured this out in my cruet. This is a cup and a half. Uh, here is my six ounces of tomato paste. Okay, I'm on, I'm on live. You are now too. Right, so that's in there. My beans are in the microwave. I'm just going to bring this together. Now this is completely my own thing. This is not part of the recipe. I'm going to put a splash of Worcestershire sauce in. And I'm also going to put one tablespoon of brown sugar in. That is just our family's preference. We like it just a touch sweeter and kind of like that tang, that sweet and sour, or that tanginess. Um, that's the nice thing about Epicures. You can really, um, you know, start with the basic recipe and go from there. All right, so I've mixed this all together. I'm actually going to go in with my meat separator and... your meat thawed out and those recipes are on the back of the package pretty much everything has a microwave and a stovetop recipe 
All right, so we'll see you back here in just a couple minutes. Okay, we are back. Our beans have cooked for three minutes. Our sloppy joes have gone back in uh, for two minutes. And here's what we've got. So I have a kid standing over my shoulder, ready to eat. Sloppy Joe and some baked beans. And our lunch is served.